Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for the Aries Sun, Moon, and Rising Sign. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This is a positive week. <laughs> um, okay. Um, this is the last week of um, November 2017. The week begins from the 27th until the 3rd of December. This is the fifth week and last week, and the energy in this week is an earth energy. Thank God the energy of the hurt comes in in this week to bring in balance. So this is good for you, Aries. There are a lot of stuff that is happening. There's heart heartbreak, heartache for a lot of you, Aries, in this week. Um, there is changes that is coming up, but have no fear. You or ha you have a strong balance, a strong stability. Okay, you will overcome whatever this heartbreak is in. Um, this week okay it's a Monday but the energy can be any day of the week for the rest of the people okay it doesn't have to be on Monday so expect a little disappointment for you Aries in this week let's go and see what else is going to be happening for you Aries um, actually the zodiac energy is fire and the earth energy so the hurt and fire energy is going to bring a lot of stability in your world okay so no matter what is happening the heartbreaks and the stuff that is happening no matter what is happening understand that and you have the energy of the emperor a hurt sign that is here so there are things that is going to happen with your boss maybe you're going to hear that um, your contract is cancelled for some of you because there's art hates let's go and see what is really going to transpire um the aries is the energy of the men so it could be that you men are going to be leaving a relationship behind or someone is leaving you behind so a lot of things are playing out not to worry you have a strong foundation so let's see what this heartbreak is all about opposition seven of swords the empress comes in to help you guys um, the king of cups comes in to help you guys the three of ones you are going to um, understand certain things the energy of balance come in which is the energy vibration of this week on Saturday you have the fool you're going on a new journey on Sunday there is a victory and glory for you and let's see what is happening you have the king of swords you have to deal with the king of swords in this week okay so let's look again but you know um, you have a very um, um, a strong foundation against this king of swords so you are going to deal with an Aries a Leo no an, an Aquarius a Gemini or a Leo in this week um, whoever you are you you know that you have a strong balance against this person no matter what he comes with and no matter what he's screaming and no matter how he is waving um, with his words and all of that or whatever he, he is going to try to do against you you have a strong foundation against him so um, your fire sign this man can come at you from all different directions and uh, all different situations but stand firm because you are going to learn to balance out whatever is happening so let's look at your spread in this week to see what is happening on Monday you have the swords the energy of the swords and you have the three of swords so um, you had art break and the opposition um, that stand against you um, is you're not protecting yourself you know you're not protecting yourself the opposition that was standing the seven of swords but you weren't protecting yourself properly and um, there was a theft that has happened um, people um, did something there was um, someone who did something injustice someone tried to steal something from you and you were heartbroken and I'm going to look and see what has transpired what was stolen and why you were heartbreak and um, there's a lot of situation that is happening in this week and 
And this energy of the three of swords because obviously you are heartbreakers some, about something whatever that was stolen there was something that was stolen you weren't protecting yourself good and let's see what has transpired here there was um, um a sort of a powerful energy or um somebody that thought they had power that try and stole something from you and it's it's not happening because um, people are coming in and this could be a woman for some people and this could be for some people someone who um, try to be as and, and, and be as if they're powerful or something but they're lying they use their power in a way and they try to steal something from you that was um, dishonest okay and they have been caught because this is now finished because the power somebody or an organization or a mother figure or somebody in power or somebody in power saw this happening and they uh, make a they, um, step in and stop that you have the four of cups this is not a sign of regrets this is a sign of planning you have the four of um, um, cups and it has to do with the Empress okay so what is happening is that you really have nothing to worry about okay your worries about your materialistic your financial situations and so you have no need to worry because this is going to work out even better than you were thinking about because the four of cups is a sort of a regrets but the empress comes in to let you know that there are new things on the horizon that is coming for you okay so whatever your um whatever that you're looking forward whatever the materialistic needs that you have in your that you need in your life she is going to be helping you okay because this is a major oracle that comes in so on tuesday you have you know the cups the four of cups which is regrets but this regrets is actually that you're thinking what how what are you going to do you need help you you, you need um help with your um to survive you need a survival help for you to survive and you need not to worry okay because you have been watched over and this is going to happen for you the crowning of your week you have the energy of the emperor the energy of the hamper is the crowning of your week and the emperor comes in because this is an earth energy and this is yourself especially for you men there is going to be a connection between you and this king of cups okay and this king of cups it can be a pisces a cancer or a scorpion so you men and um um some of you this could be a father some of you um this could be a business partner and some of you it's going to um, affect you as um um this man is coming in your life in a relationship form of so and i'm going to ask who is this king of cups and why is he here what is the reason for this king of cups okay he is going to bring you success he's going to help you to be very successful this king of cups okay so um this king of cups could be coming in as someone who's going to bring out the best in you it's going to really take you to that place of success this king of cups was sent um through, um, through the universal um, angels and guides your angels and guides this king of cups was sent to you in your life to make a transition to make you be the star who you truly are okay so don't worry about the situation don't worry about what is happening um, this king of cups come in your life for a reason he was sent by for some of you he was sent um, we, uh, you know sometimes you call up from um, call up for help and you think that the help doesn't come but the help does come because this king of cups come in your life and this king of cups is going to bring out the best in you for some of you especially in your work if you have your own business and that sort of a thing this king of cups is going to come in and help you because um 
whatever the situation is he's gonna help you to protect you against this king of sword which is and this king of cups is um a pisces a cancer or a capricorn this is a very good person come in in a good way because he's bringing you the energy of the star there's love this person has a lot of love for you so open up your heart because they're here to help you and not work against you okay um on thursday you have the eight of swords in reverse you're seeing a situation as it is you're not sure what you need what you want to do it's fate um, it's as if you realize that something is a ray um, um, you know the three of ones is always a victory and a standing over something but you're not failing that way it's always working together with people the three of ones is always you know you see a situation for what it is and you want to move away from the situation you want to leave this situation behind and um move forward and look for something much better in your life okay um whatever happened it is fate it is the fate so i'm not seeing an ending but i'm seeing that a lot of things has transpired um because on monday you felt so heartbroken and it's not that someone is leaving you but someone something was stolen from you that you're not being so happy with okay on friday you have also the seven of swords two times it comes up in reverse what's the ever that was stolen from you will be returned have some balance have time because this is going to be returned to you but you need to you know let it go ask the universal angels for you know divine intervention in this situation because something was stolen from you okay it comes up twice something was stolen from you the seven of swords is in reverse because when it's upright is um someone trying to get away with something and someone something was stolen from you and what is happening here is that um take the time to balance out the situation whatever this is and whatever what was stolen um you know it will come back but it's going to take time okay it's going to take time on saturday you have the seven of pentacles on saturday and with the seven of pentacles you are trying to find um balance in your financial situation and you're looking some of you will be looking to find a new job or new um ways of um, healing your financial situation and you will find it the seven of pentacles is that you know you're there you're trying to plan you thought this was going to work out it's not going to work out or maybe um it's not um there is something that is blocking it and you're not seeing what is happening and you know maybe you have your own business and you're thinking of giving up don't give up don't give up just keep on going because you're going to be surprised okay just don't give up keep on going um because you want to leave something behind but don't give up because there's going to be a success because the glory is going to come in for you um on sunday you have the energy of the five of pentacles in reverse yes because whatever your financial situation is it's going to get better it's going to get better because the energy of glory is coming in as the six of one so news on sunday or maybe in the week it doesn't really have to mean that it's on sunday because the um balancing out of your week is the energies of pentacles and it's the energy of the hurt sign so the empress is here and she came to let you know that you're financial needs whatever you need will be given to you and all you have to do is call upon the empress call upon the universe call up for help and 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 start asking for help sunday good news is going to come to you glory is going to come to you good um things are going to come to you on sunday is as if whatever you have been praying for in the week because whatever that was lost whatever that was stolen is um going to come back to you but you have to ask for help okay and sometimes it's best to let it go and once you let go what has transpired you're going to see that it is going to really work out let's see 
what you have as the answer from the angel you have compromise compromise so i guess um and, and and it's hard to compromise especially when people have been lying and deceiving and cheating it is so very hard to compromise and i'm telling you this because I have it too because whenever you look at someone and situation you know that people have been lying and being so deceitful how can you compromise with that person it is a, a situation that you will never trust again because they the deceitfulness that has happened okay um the other energy I'm working with is the conscious energy and some people are always saying forgive and forget I forgive I'm not forgetting okay and I will hold it to my grave because I will forgive you, but I'm not forgetting because the less is there to learn. So compromise, okay, I will say hi and I will say hello, but I will never forgive you for what you have done. I, I will forgive you for what you have done, but I will never forget. <laughs> you know um so compromise i don't think um um compromise is a good energy and you have to be in a place an art place where you can really compromise with people honestly so i'm not it's up to you um you know the the energies are here feel what is happening for you the conscious spirit message to you is the crown chakra I know I am part of source and my life is guided by the divine wisdom so it is so and it will be so you need to work on your crown chakras by working on your crown chakras in this week a lot of messages are going to come in I know I am part of source and my life is guided by divine wisdom so I know I'm part of source and my life is guided by divine wisdom wisdom and this is the energy this is what is working out for you in your life this is going to be good i want to say to each and every person whatever is happening the number sevens are here three times you have seven number 77 777 so remember if you, if someone who is a pisces um if someone who is a pisces a scorpion a Pisces a scorpion or a cancer comes in your life it is for a reason this person was sent to you um, door the universal angels and guide to help you he is going to be helping you in whatever situation that you have to deal with do not worry about your materialistic thing your weekend is very balanced because I've seen some people weekend which is not looking that good your weekend is balanced you have the seven of pentacles that means whatever your financial needs is it's going to be met the energy of the fool is going to open up new doors for you the energy of the five of pentacles is in reverse so this is good and good news glory is about to come in for you money is going to come to you so whatever that has happened whatever that has transpired um yeah uh, you know try come um come compromise but it is hard I'm not going to tell you that it's going to be easy um, compromising it's going to be hard for a lot of people some people can be, do it very well I am one of those people that I think okay I can compromise with you but I'm giving you again a little finger and you're going to make advantage of it so it's up to you my darlings I am showing you what is going to happen and it's up to you to make a decision namaste please like share these videos <laughs>